here we have Camarilla and her daughters. Yeah, I was going to do this, but I forgot to do some other characters for her. But it's funny, I did her. She did make a previous cameo appearance in the pilot episode, non speaking part, with in the same scene where Zest Jill was having tea. She was opening a curtain with Zest doing the right behind her. Her daughters weren't in that scene, but they were with. They were out by Rosie's shop dealing with an old enemy that already died during at the end of the purge. There is these two. I have no idea about, but I'm just starting to get to know their mother more. I'm starting to like the how she designed those large claws that seem to be built into her gloves, or is they part of skin? It's hard to tell for her. She's very well mannered and often easily lose her cool, but she's always too serious from the way I've seen her in the show so far. She seems to have a take a lot of information from ballet dancers from the way she has a, so she wears those socks on one scene. She made her biggest appearance in the meaning scene with Alistair, the other overlord, got into a big song battle with fell away from the V's <laughs> about respect. And it was revealed afterwards that Hell, it was right about her suspicions, even though she never confirmed it with Carmilla. Carmilla. That it turns out that it was that Carmilla is the one who killed the the ain't the exorcist whose head fell had found, <laughs> and it turns out it was a symbol when she did it. Exorcist. The angels that come down to, to their world once a year to kill with the Oprah population by killing a certain bunch of people would. Well, it turns out the same weapon they used to kill demons is to, can also kill the angels. <laughs> Talk about their irony. And I noticed that Carmilla's. Shields are kind of looks like they'd be made from angel weapon, angelic weapons. I would like to get some more screen time in hear some backstories about her daughters. Her always by her side, but they seem to have a very loving relationship with their mother. You know, they had to talk her to revealing some stuff about the whole plot too. Zestial, she didn't want to reveal to everyone that she was the one who killed an angel. <laughs> well, having guts, but she did make a good point to Baggy as a what also mattered during that song Out for Love. Now, if you're going to fight someone, it shouldn't be out for blood or vengeance. You gotta fight for those you are afraid to lose. That can bring out real power. Anyway, here is Carmilla and her daughters, Claire and Odette.